Welcome to this series where we are playing the 1.10 update for Imperium Galactic Survival. In the last part, we finished off the radar station, went to the Xeno mainframe, and got a bit of loot. And in this part, what I want to do is where are we going? Find its story. Is it story? Got ancient revelations. We've got to go to Simos, the barren planet, and find the uh, Illyrium. That's what we want to do. But before that, as usual, a big thank you for all your comments and feedback. You guys give me a lot to think about. Now, one thing I did do off camera is I spent a little bit of time going round and doing some mining. Unfortunately, I kind of filled the <laughs> the storage up so with all the ore. So at the moment, I'm busily engaged in reducing all the ore that I got back down to um, ingots to try and save a little bit of space. But on the positive side, it means that we got plenty of copper. Uh, I, I picked up, also picked up some cobalt. Where is it? Yeah, we got plenty of cobalt now. I picked up a few trees as well. And also I mined some Neo as well, which needs to be reduced to ingots as well. So it means I shouldn't be running short of resources. It just means I've got to lug them around a little bit. Anyway, let's just get in. It's time to leave this planet. Imperial drive. Got to get used to the Imperium uh, controls now. Because I've been playing a little bit on Spaceborne. It's always the problem when you play multiple space games. is They've got similar keys, but at the same time they're different. They do different things. And you can, can get into a little bit of a problem with that. Now you're up in space. We've got the shields on. And what we've got to do is Simos, isn't it? I presume we can go directly to the planet or target. It shouldn't be that far away because it's all within the same system. Oh, don't tell me I've got to. It's going to be on the other side of the planet. Yeah. We might be able to get away with this, but. Just got to be able to jump into warp drive before you actually hit the atmosphere. It's destroyed small vessel 29.85 kilometers away. So here we are. They must throw out a thing. Wow, there's quite a lot here. What's what we got in the way? Cobalt, we got an ice asteroid. I certainly wouldn't mind that. It's obviously telling us we've got to go to that direction. I think that's the actual destroyed ship, but we've got to go somewhere else first. We've got, uh, I think, I'm not sure what they are, but they look like Polaris, not hostiles. I certainly wouldn't, maybe the ice asteroid could be quite useful. Anyway, what we're going to do is head for the small destroyed ship. It's going to take a little while to get there, so... I'll see you once we arrive. So here we are, which is coming up on the destroyed small vessel. Now, all these other things around here are most likely, I think if I remember correctly, it's a minefield. Destroyed vessel. Don't really want to get in. Yeah, you can see it says there, Polaris mine. I think what we'll do is we'll just get in a little bit closer. Some destroyed vessels around here. Just level off. And uh, cross this off. I'm not sure about the spacing with respect to the uh, mine, so we use the SV to go in. Actually, I just had a thought as well. Uh, we're going to need an EVA boost because we're going to be operating in space. So, up here. Just, I mean, we could fly in manually, but yeah, oxygen. There's ancient revelations. Find the vessel. It says the destroyed small vessel down there.
think we got to get to the control station. I suppose we got to. Two speed, a minefield, yeah. But it, there is a gap in. It's not difficult. Just assessing the situation. I think we can come in from this direction. We can get there. Access the station and go ahead. Come in from this direction. I don't think the minds are that sensitive. Famous last words. I think that the entrance is like a. Oh. Yeah, that, I think that's the entrance just there. Drop down a bit. Get closer. Check any console for logs of reported incidents of the Alumarium. I think that's how you pronounce it. Oops. Back off. I don't think there are any hostiles in here. There's the teleporter. Oh, we got definition. Not allowed. I think we can open those. But the switches are the other side. So there. That's not active. Here's the console. Okay, console. Error, error, error. Retry. These just station 04 minefield control hub. Punch the console. <laughs> Override code accepted. Mate, please make make your choice. Deactivate minefield. An unexpected error occurred. Do you want to send the error information to the service crew? Restart. There is an open application running. Message two three nine. Close anyway. Show message. This is a warning to the pilot approaching this station. Hold your distance and pick up this message and relay it to Polaris HQ. The Elmerium is heading for this planet, but it was. The, the Ilmerian is heading for this planet, but it's not under our control. We picked up something up which killed the entire crew and is taking control of the ship. We managed to survive long enough to destroy the station and send this recorded warning, but in, but no doubt we are already dead. Do not search for survivors, or, and but destroy the ship and the station as well with the strongest weapons you have. Do not leave even dust. Chief St. John was right from the very beginning. We might have revived dark times. May the galaxy forgive us. Um... Right, let's just find way inside. I think there's a switch here. What's that? Oh, that opened. That. Have we got some loot? Anyway, certainly take that. <laughs> I think there's one the other side as well. Um, doors open. Can we open them. Whoops. that opens up this one I think that's about all the loot that's on here got a health kit build then lots of kit hooked on here we go this way and then we go in here Teleport through, which takes us to the Illyrium, El Elmerium. Short range teleporter, and here we are. Of course, we're not going to do anything, we're just going to get back in the teleporter and get back the other way. In fact, what I'll do is we'll just there's some loot boxes here. We'll, we'll pick the loot up before we leave just to. Ammunition could be quite useful. Not sure what I'm going to do with all these safety in plates. Not anything in the locker, but that's okay. Um, I think if you flip that, it blows up. No, no, okay. Uh -huh. 
But where we gotta go is down here. But first we're gonna go and get the ship. We'll go and get back in the water. I mean, there's some destroyed vessels in here, but I've never really I can just check out one and see what the loot situation is. I don't think the loot is anything particularly excessively special in them. But uh, just take a quick look. As I say, it's it, they're more just decorative. As far as I know, there's no great loot in there. Unless, of course, you just want some steel plates. I think we, I think you can mine them out. Uh, just salvage. Yeah, I mean, if you want some steel plates. Just... Oh, wow. Okay. Ah. Famous last words. So there is a little bit in here. It's just kind of hidden away a little bit. Power cells. Oh, there's a tree there. Ammunition on. So, there's, there's the odd bits of loot. There's the core if you really want to take it. Don't really want to spend too long doing that. And I've lost my ship. There it is. I'm looking at the bottom of the ship. So yeah, but as I say, I don't think there's anything special. Got to get back to Marsh. Yep, there. So what I'm going to do now is just make my way back to the ship. And then of course I'm going to need to get in the ship and then fly all the way back to the Almerium. I'll see you once I get there. I think they're firing at whatever's inside the ship, seeing it as hostile. Now on the way back, I, where is it? <laughs> I found a co copper asteroid, a cobalt asteroid, and a promethium asteroid there. So, so we kind of found those. Obviously, we got some more out that way. Anyway, we're going to get close to the ship now. The entrance is actually, I think, the best place to put the ship. If we park alongside right about there, put you put you right up alongside there, like that. Rust us off. I think what we'll do is we'll use the SV and land on in there. First things first, we'll go back and I want to check the crops. If we've got any harvest there. So we've got a little bit of a your pre harvest, your pre harvest growing, growing. Berries are growing quite quickly. Mushrooms up as well natural sweeteners matured you're growing you're growing you're growing buds as well and we got some veggies shove that in the raw food i pulled across a multi boost uh, simply because we may we can use that because one of the problems with this ship is that if there's a mixture of environments, there's parts where oh, must have taken my helmet off by accident. Yeah, there's a mixture of uh, how you can say of environments. Some parts of the ship are got air, other parts haven't. So the temperature can fluctuate, but I think the main part is actually. Or air, but as we saw just um, earlier on 
is there is an armor locker. I mean, I could take the ship inside, but I'm not going to bother too much about that. I could just put it there. Turn the thrusters off. And we can get it off. Mm -hmm. I do is you can see the temperature in here is good, so we can take off the EVA boost and put on the multi boost. We don't need the epic drill. We're going to be drilling anything, so this up a bit personal weapons that there that off as well I don't need that probably don't I think I'll keep the mold the boost with me just in case <laughs> and what we've got to do is make sure we've got weapons there yeah I think we've got enough so what we're going to do is go down through these blast doors here, but to get to those, we've got to go around in the terminal here. Computer system safe mode. Press any key to review automatically. Press any key. Uh, logo hazardous substance warning issued by container radiation foreign biological. Yeah, radiation's another factor. There's crew members low power detected. <laughs> wow. Okay. Well, uh, no. Okay. Okay. Find way in. Okay. Can't go that way. Don't understand that should open with that terminal. Let's say here. Oh, there's the switch. I think that. No, it still says not allowed. Okay. Oh, is it two switches? Ship is in full lockdown, but we need to go to the bridge to access the captains. Yeah. Yeah, I missed the switches. <laughs> a little while since I've done this. Got a kind of series of rooms through here. And it's all locked. So, you, so what you've got to do is kind of follow a path through the ship. So the bridge is at the top. We've got bugger bees here. So we go all the way up. Or... Door. No, I don't think we've got to the top yet. Yeah. What What are you doing here? Who are, is there? Join, leave, or IDA. Did you hit, track that voice? My sensors do not track any voice or sound other than the metallic noise of the steel possibly deforming. Please wait. I'm detecting movement on this level. I'm absolutely sure this was not the moment ago. Okay. I don't think you can get through here. Oh, I'll take the food pack. But uh, here, laser rifle. Um, capture 115. Oh, I still got me crossbow y thing, and I. Um, <laughs> not allowed there, so we've got to go around this way. So it's cruise quarters. There's lots of bug uglies in there just waiting for me to go up onto the. There they are. Hello, Mr. Screaming Ab there. There's an emergency exit. This is the... Wow. Okay. That hurt. Um. <laughs> yeah, that was a bit antisocial. Um, what have we got here? Three hundred. Just pop that. Bandage. 
when we got the spike mushrooms, that can be 150. Uh, <sighs> I think we'll just cut the bandages at the moment. Yeah, there's another turret up here now, if I remember correctly. It's there. <laughs> Reload. This thing would be any better. Access can the console review logs. It should give a hint to what happened. Yeah, bad news. Acting captain's log. Something in the cargo we were carrying was breached containment. We've been affecting both both the ship and the crew. It started as nothing more than a few headaches, but before long we spent this, it spread to the entire crew. Slowly they became delusional and had to be locked in their quarters to um, avoid, avoid being violent. Uh, whatever it was, the contents of the cargo, it's been hard to work while they've been trying to contain the crew. Right, I'm just not going to read all that lot. Basically, the crew has been taken over. Um, there was a lockdown over near the bridge, yep. Back to... Flip that. That's gonna let Ah you made your choice. Be joyful. Uh get out of my mind. Tracking a lot of movement all of a sudden. We need to find a way out of the core and destroy the ship. Lock and load. <laughs> now Let's put the jetpack on. was a little bit too exciting and um, luckily we didn't catch any bug ugly it's actually white mushroom time and so use a um, bear on route as well yeah that was uh, caught me off guard um, Yeah, we've got to get back now. Need to get back off some walk. It'll be a little... <laughs> I loot one just for luck. We've the rooms here we'll take that this isn't the way out but there's some little bit of loot in here yeah, it's just <sighs> what was that Social. <sighs> Thing in here. Okay, it sounds like there's some Xerox around. Or infected. <laughs> but yeah. Head kit. Okay. 
can't really get out that way. We've got to go back up and out the other way. Um, this way, isn't it? This goes outside. Bandages. Still here, somebody there. Go to the shotgun. Still up close and personal. Wow. Going through the bandages to make some more. Oh, these are two joined together. That explains why there was two of them in here. So, bugger beer. Bunk bed belt as we've already been in here. Um, right, let's come. Okay, reload. <laughs> One more damp. Always wanted to drill, and then that's the flip side of here. Have a laser rifle. Then we just got some showers. Go to level five. Is here. Okay. Level six. Uh, toilet, nothing in there. Nope. It's not allowed. Maybe we need to go to some. Maybe we give the old Allen charge shotgun thing. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> I think we need to just back up a little bit and do a bit of unloading. The uh, food in there, meds Med in there, doesn't work. Put these up. Oh, infected food, poison spike, parasites, yeah. Take some of those with us. Um, these are uh, endoparasites, don't need that. Got those. Dub these in. So, like, look, look. Put everything in trade weapons for the moment. Got a little bit too much in the way of ammunition for the go away. Ha <laughs> ha. <sighs> yep. 
Yeah, shoot at me. All right, we've got more drills. You got anything? You kits? We need those. And we've got here wardrobe. Back. I think we just woke up the boys next door. Now, don't want to go in there. It's right up in just inside of there. Is the that we can get the angle here. turret because then it would give me more get the angle on that gives us a little bit of control here um well we've got the boys in there Oh, that was fairly <sighs> measured. <laughs> okay. Don't. Oh. Bit of a trap there. Uh, okay. Let's just have a bit of an unload. Food, get that, that, uh, uh, ammo, that needs to go there, right, the rest, keep the hot beverage, uh, put this in miscellaneous at the moment, oh, nearly missed that, oh yeah, Certainly want that lot. <laughs> Any production? I go, please. Who the heck is firing at me? I think what we can do is because we've got control of the room over here. You. Okay, we don't have a lot of ammunition for this thing, but this. Okay. Infected, badly infected. <laughs> uh, whoops. Okay, what we got? Okay, what we got? Got dermal parasites. That is that one. And we got endo parasites. Is that one? And we need the bandages. Um, here, not raw food, food and meds, take that, but 
do that as well. Don't work. <sighs> Bandage. Back off. <sighs> right. Got a ventilation control. Find the ventilation control. Yep. Um. Got the room cleared. This is just a switch. Now we've got to be a bit careful with the sequence. I think if I remember correctly. Um. Okay. The vent ventilation. Moving to our position. Okay. Full cool lever. This did not unlock the direct access to Cargo Bay 2. I'm afraid you need to go back to the staircase and to level 4. I think we've just opened up. Is fuck ugly. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Go back to what's that? <laughs> right, we got to get to the maintenance deck. Did I loot you? Yeah. Um, I remember this weird room. All black inside. It's a bit weirdy. Got this strange console here. Okay, responsive, close. Um, this Good box up here. Oops. That's there. I think there's oh some ammo. We can put that directly into the ship. Ammo. All of the con uh, corridors, the bit of a labyrinth, find the bad surprises. I have a mark on the screen. Find the exit. Enter deck. I, somehow I've managed to enter the deck without actually entering the deck. Uh, water. Some oxygen. Oops, where am I now? Trapped a bit. Where am I? Yeah. Maintenance level four. Okay, we go down one level four. Yeah, this is the Oops. Spiky mushrooms. Where that I'm running out of time on this video, and we've got to go down. Where are we? We're on level five. I think this would be a good point to stop because level four is now it goes down a bit further, and and then we get a lot more involved. So this is where I'm going to leave it. Hope you enjoyed the episode. Hope you found it interesting. What I'll do is just check my armor. Uh, let me just see. Oh, the armor's in good condition. This is where I'm going to leave it. In the next part, we'll carry on down through level four and through the various levels to get to the final core. But until next time, whatever you do, enjoy your gaming.